What's up everyone? Supreme Decisions here and today I have some juicy for you because this is one of the first episodes we're going to do with weaponizing your defense. And a part of a great defense is a great offense. Now what happens is a lot of times we have inklings that there is a malicious prosecution going on. Did you know that you have an opportunity to file a motion for sanctions? Now, a motion for sanctions must be filed separately. It can be filed with specific details of what actually happened or a brief description of the infraction, similar to when you're doing a federal court removal. There must be a brief description. You don't want to write a 20-page letter when you're trying to just get things moving because again the law of numbers nobody's reading a bunch of stuff they don't have to get to the point one of the great parts about the motion for sanctions it must be done within 21 days of the infraction or you're going to have to go through a couple other means but you can still get it done and include it into your case so just keep that in mind motion for sanctions when you're setting up or you believe a malicious prosecution is afoot so we're going to keep going we're going to keep growing i want you guys to take note that we're going to be using all the tools at our disposal to keep growing as a group the master class is going to kick off and be phenomenal so if you haven't joined the channel join if you haven't joined the master class get that hundred dollars ready get just going it's getting ready to be great 2022 so that's all i have for today Keep a lookout for it because, again, we're going to keep going, keep growing. Supreme, out.